We're announcing the expansion of Project Suite. Project Suite has been around for very many years. All my colleagues here have been involved in trying to do whatever we can together to make sure the neighborhood, the quality of life in this neighborhood is, is great. Project Suite is a project that has worked over the years in keeping the neighborhood clean and safe and beautiful and at the same time giving people work. So we are expanding Project Suite with the grant that I was able to get, a $100,000 grant through the New York State Senate. The Project Suite will now extend throughout three main commercial strips in Burr Park. 13th Avenue, 16th Avenue, 18th Avenue, from 38th Street to 60th Street. Our heroes and heroines from Project Sweep will be going out every morning, Monday through Friday, to keep this neighborhood clean. Keeping the commercial strips clean is a win-win on all fronts. It keeps the neighborhood clean, and we know clean neighborhoods are safe neighborhoods. And at the same time, it gives people jobs, gives people a chance to earn my, um, uh, money and feel good and feel productive. So this is uh, this is just great. It's a win-win all along. It's holiday, New Year time. It's a it's a great time to announce something that's beneficial to everybody. The store owners here are busy trying to earn a living. People are trying to earn a living. What else can be better at this point? I'd like to introduce my colleague Assemblyman Dove Heiken. First of all, I want to thank Simcha for, uh, for leading the charge on something very, very important. Uh, we have a community here, uh, an amazing community. It's a community of children, uh, large families, thank God, a lot of children, which means a lot of people in the streets, especially the main thoroughfares uh, that Senator Felder spoke about. A lot of people. In fact, I always uh, point out that places like 13th and 16th and 18th are some of the busiest streets in the city of New York. And while people are careful in terms of uh, throwing the garbage uh, uh, in, in the garbage can, uh, still there are a lot of people. And this is just an amazing program, Project Sweep, that will help the community. You know, when you walk in a community and the community, you know, you look at the streets and the streets look the way these streets look right now clean. That is a wonderful, wonderful thing. Now let me tell you something else that will also be fabulous uh, in terms of uh, uh, minimizing uh, sanitation violations. Uh, you know, uh, that's something that people are very concerned about. The store owners, as it is, have a difficult time surviving. Things are tough. Uh, and all of this is going to help our community uh, in a very, very big way. So this is... Uh, this is wonderful. My office is on 13th Avenue and again, one of the busiest streets, not in Borough Park, but one of the busiest streets in Brooklyn and maybe even beyond. So again, Senator Felder, thank you very much for leading the charge. Uh, it, it's things like this, Project Sweep, that makes such a great difference for our community. You know, uh, some people would say, oh, that's a little thing. No, this is a huge thing because to keep a community clean is something that's very, very, very fundamental. Uh, and, and anyway, this is just a great, great thing uh, to help the community to keep our streets even cleaner than they are at the present time. So thank you very much. Uh, now, Councilman David Greenfield, I just want to mention that Project Suite something that was created by the Midwest Development Corporation and is something that we're hoping will spread not only in the areas here, we know that in Manhattan in the fancy neighborhoods they have a variety of other types of projects like this, but we're hoping that these types of programs will benefit uh, other neighborhoods in the city as well. You know, we used to have a senator in New York, Al D'Amato, he was called Senator Pothole. Uh, we have a senator here in Borough Park in Midwood, we call him Senator Clean, because he is a senator who focused for years, even before he was elected to the New York State Senate, focusing on cleaning up our streets. 
We still have uh, trash cans in our community that have his name on it. I see that we now have Senator Sempfelder supports Project Sweep. And so we thank you, Senator, for focusing on the cleanliness of our community. And really, nothing is more important than clean streets. I mean, these are the communities that we live in, we play in, we work in, and the cleanliness of our streets are really paramount. So, Senator, I want to thank you for your leadership. I also want to thank you especially for expanding the program. As the Assemblyman mentioned, he's on 13th Avenue, I'm on 16th Avenue, I know that you're on 16th Avenue now as well. And these are really the main commercial strips in our uh, community. Uh, and incidentally, speaking to your point, uh, we have worked uh, in the city to try to expand uh, the programs for cleanup. I was proud in the council to sponsor NYC Cleanup with this initiative to try to bring it to every uh, community. But the truth is that if every community had a Senator Felder, we wouldn't have to worry because every community would have, in fact, clean streets. And uh, I'm really excited because, you know, sometimes you come to these events and you see empty garbage cans. I'm happy to see the garbage cans already have garbage in them. Uh, which means that the work is already getting done. So this is a really a terrific initiative. I want to thank you. I'm proud to support it and uh, really grateful for your leadership, Senator. And I think that by making our streets cleaner, we all will be really proud to continue living in this neighborhood for many years to come. So thank you very much. Thank you. Sam Moskowitz from Project Suite. I, uh, I just wanted to thank both Senator Felder and uh, Councilman Greenfield and Assemblyman Heiken for their support. Um, Project Sweep has been existing since 1989, employing disabled adults and uh, non-disabled adults on integrated work crews throughout Brooklyn. And I'm proud to say we have 65 employees in the program now. And I'm um, looking forward to many more years of success with Project Sweep. Thank you all for coming. So, so just to recap, Project Suite is right now, we're expanding Project Suite to cover the three main commercial strips in Borough Park, 13th Avenue, 16th Avenue, 18th Avenue. And Project Suite's heroes and heroines here are gonna be out every morning through, through rain, snow, hot, cold. They used to they say that about the male people, but we're going to make sure that the neighborhoods are clean, and clean neighborhoods are safe neighborhoods. Safe neighborhoods are where people want to come and shop and feel good. And it gives the opportunity for people to earn money and feel productive at the same time. Uh, when I was chair of the sanitation committee in the city council, sanitation is something that people don't like to talk about that much. But one thing we do know, is that some of our neighbors on the east side of Manhattan don't want a plant, a sanitation plant near, near them to pick, you know, take care of their garbage. We are proud to have Project Sweet. Uh, we are trying to do something productive, something positive to make sure our neighborhoods stay, uh, stay nice and clean and safe. And yes, yes. This is a hundred thousand dollar Senate grant that's for this coming year. And as I've said, both Assemblyman Hyken in the past and Councilman Greenfield presently have funded projects like this incrementally throughout the years. What we're trying to do is make this project suite funding something that will be a recurring funding stream. Right now it's not, but we're committed to making sure that store owners don't have an additional expense to keep the neighborhoods clean. The sanitation uh, or sanitation people, they work very hard and they don't get paid enough and there's just so much they can do and the streets really need to be kept clean. So this is a grant for this, for this year, for these three main commercial strips. It's something that we want done throughout the city, God willing, and help clean up uh, permanently. Through the end of 2015? That's correct. That's correct. Any other questions? Um, you said it before, but it was it, you said the three main... The three main, three main commercial strips that run right through Borough Park. 13th Avenue, 16th Avenue, and 18th Avenue will be swept Monday through Friday every morning, making it, making it the safest, cleanest neighborhood. Come and shop in Borough Park. And before this, the store owners had to do this themselves? Well, with this in no way 
takes away the responsibility of store owners to keep their shops clean during <laughs> routing hours. What we are doing here is we're saying this is one of the best places to shop in the world. And it's busy and no matter what, we want to make sure that during the day it's kept clean and they have the assistance, additional help, my project suite to keep it that way. Let me just uh, mention uh, that people come from all over to shop here. If you are here on a Sunday, on a Thursday, on a Friday, you will meet people from the five boroughs, from Long Island and further who come to this community to shop because this community offers things that many other communities do not. Uh, so when you're out on the streets and you meet people, you'll find out that people come specifically to this neighborhood to shop. So we have a lot more traffic here, just like you have in Manhattan, just like you have on Broadway in Manhattan or uh, 42nd Street. So we need that extra. And uh, thank God we're getting it as a result of uh, Senator Felder. Uh, if you ask my colleagues, yeah, I can tell you that you can get the best buys in Borough Park. Without advertising, we'll beat any price. I guarantee that the neighborhood shops here in our district, we can beat any price anywhere else. Money back guarantee. Uh, so come and shop, but I, I want to emphasize again that this project that Councilman Greenfield, myself, and Assemblyman Hyken are so invested in is something that not only keeps the neighborhood clean, but it's holiday time, it's New Year time. We are committed, as well as all New Yorkers, to doing something to help make sure that everyone has something to celebrate during this time of year. And the uh, people here from Project Sweep will have jobs, will feel productive, and help make this neighborhood a beautiful neighborhood. So I want to give them another round of applause. Lando, I, I want to say it's, been, it's Alex Landa. L-A-N-D-A-U. It's been a week since I've seen them here on the street. I didn't know what this is about, and I never heard of this project until today. And let me tell you, it's a major difference. Major difference. I mean, this, you know, like Assemblyman Hyken said, that there are that many people out there, and obviously when there's that many people, you have more garbage on the street. Yet, to see them out there and to see them you know, helping us out over here and which they're doing because to us we try to catch up with it but it's a very hard thing to catch up with that massive amount of, of small garbage for which we get ticketed for. To see them out there and you know I just have to thank Senator Felder, Assemblyman Hyken, Councilman Greenfield. Thank you very much from us over here at Goldberg's Grocery for helping us out and, and the community. Also which, get a money back guarantee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's your role at Goldbergs? I'm the manager. You're the manager, okay. Yeah. Hi, I'm just buzzing for you. Right. Don't want to. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, so you know, yeah. 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 you know yeah. that deal. So this is great. Yeah. Right. Come here, I'm gonna come here to shop again. Oh, you're going to the 